I am going to be making egg curry. It's simple and very fast. If you're feeling lazy and you don't feel like cooking, this is a very fast recipe. You'll be done in no time. So this will help me to carefully place my eggs in the water because I don't want to burn my fingers. See? Aha. Uh -huh. Nailed it. You're going to boil your eggs for 10 minutes. Is my eggs boiled? I'm going to be chopping my onion to make our curry. So I'm going to pick a knife. Then I'll chop my onion. Because I want to multitask, I'm going to pick my pan. Then I'm going to transfer my pot to my other burner. Two tablespoons of cooking oil. Then I'll add in my onions. Then you're going to cook this until soft. As my onion cooks, I'm going to be chopping up my coriander stems. I add coriander stems in everything. Add this to my pan. Sa. Next, I'll add my tomatoes. them up to whatever size you like <laughs> you also check on your onions now that I'm done chopping my tomatoes I'm going to move over to the pan and check on my onions and they're looking amazing and that coriander is so fragrant next I'm going to add my tomatoes cook this until mushy or cooked through As my tomatoes are cooking, I'm going to add my spices. You can check out the spices I'm using in the description box. Then I'll add half a teaspoon of ginger, ground ginger. Half a teaspoon of salt. Then I'll add half a tablespoon of tomato paste. Stuff. This is how my tomatoes are looking and they are almost cooking through. So I'm going to check on my eggs and they're ready. Turn off the heat. Now I'm going to drain the water and then I'll run cold water on the eggs so that it can be easy to peel. I'm done peeling my eggs. Next, I'm going to add this in my, in my tomato sauce. Then I'll stir and cut all the eggs with my curry. Then I reduce the heat to low. Continue stirring for about 30 seconds. Then I'm going to add a little bit of water. 
then you're going to let your eggs simmer for around two minutes my egg curry is ready so i'm going to turn off the gas for the cooker and then i'm going to add this in my bowl And I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of coriander on top. My egg curry is smelling amazing and I hope you try out this recipe because this is amazing. This is amazing. You can have this egg curry with rice or chapati and you will surely enjoy. So I hope you try out my recipe and as always don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and catch you on my next one.